Hi everyone, um, welcome to this tutorial and today we're going to learn how to open an Excel worksheet using Microsoft Visual Studio. Go. So, head over to your Microsoft Visual Studio, go to File, um, New, Project, uh, Console Application, and then we'll call it My Sheet. Click OK. And then we need to, to import a few stuff. So, we're going to do here, and we're going to say Add References, and we're going to say Microsoft. And uh, we're going to look for Microsoft Office Interop Excel. We're going to check that and then scroll down a bit. Um, we need Microsoft Studio Tools Applications Runtime. Check that one as well. Click OK. And now we're going to write them. So using, and we're going to give it, we're going to say Excel. <coughs> equals Microsoft dot office dot enter orp dot excel and the second one is using um, Microsoft um, dot visual studio dot tools dot applications dot runtime And now we're set. So we're going to write our code. So the first line of code is going to be Microsoft dot Office dot Enter Orp dot Excel. And then we do dot application. And then we're going to say Excel. So go to variable of Excel. So equals new Microsoft dot Office dot Enter orp at uh, Excel dot application. Uh, the second line of code is the location of uh, our worksheet. So Microsoft dot Office dot Enter orp dot Excel dot workbook. Um, we're gonna say sheet uh, equals Excel dot workbooks add uh, open. And then we'll have to give it a location. So um, go to your um, C drive um, and create a folder called temp, and then create an Excel sheet um, called my sheet. And then we're going to give it the location. So we're going to say uh, C double slash uh, temp double slash my sheet dot xl as x and then we're going to say microsoft dot office dot interrupt dot xl dot worksheet um, and we're going to say x equals xl dot active sheet which is here um, as Microsoft dot office dot enter or dot Excel dot worksheet and now you're set <clears throat> so what we're gonna do is we're gonna actually count um, how many records we have in the Excel sheet so we're gonna put some records in the sheet in, in the sheet and then we're gonna count how many records we have so open your worksheet and let's say uh, one two uh, two eat sleep uh, whatever and save that <coughs> and now let's write our code so we need an excel the range uh, we'll say user range equals x dot use range and then we need an int to count the records so let's say int uh, count records equals user range dot rows dot count so this will actually count the rows now we need to write 
uh, how many rows we have. But before that, we're going to do a trick. So we'll do int add equals count records plus one. Uh, I'll tell you why we're going to need this this one in particular. So we're going to say x dot. So now we are writing uh, the count of how many records we have. So cells. So we're going to do add, and then we're going to say one. So it's starting column one, row the row that's under the record count um, equals. Uh, we're going to say total rows plus count records and now you're done so to recap again so we're counting our records and we have an integer called add which will give us the value that's under our count and then we're going to use it to write under the last record and the first column and then we're going to say sheet dot close true type dot missing and then I'm just going to say type dot missing again and then we're going to say excel dot quit and we're going to save that uh, quit and then we're going to save that and now if you run it it did the job so what it did is that's what it did it, ca it counts all the rows that we had and then wrote total rows and the value um, thank you for watching the tutorial um, don't forget to like and subscribe thank you